That as oh, was Galeri with here on BBC Radio Wales. Now the BBC Weather presenter and a regular with Carol Vorderman on a Saturday morning is Owen Win Evans and he is taking on the gruelling challenge of drumming constantly for 24 hours to raise money for children in need. Well, he started at 8.35 this morning. He's eight hours in. So let's see if I can interrupt him. Excuse me, why the Larry Tony Shumai? Listen, you can always interrupt me, Carrie, you know that. <laughs> How are you doing? How are you feeling? Do you know what, Larry? I'm feeling I'm feeling all right. And actually we are you and I are chatting exactly eight hours into the challenge because I started it exactly eight hours ago now. Um, so, yeah, you know, I'm feeling okay. I'm starting to get a couple of aches and pains in the old back now, but the, mm-hmm. this is to be expected. Um, but, you know, I've been playing the drums for eight hours and as you can hear, I'm still... still Ooh. playing the drums. So uh, You've still got rhythm. Well, you know, I try, Carriad, I try... <laughs> <laughs> oh, wine! You made me howl with laughter when I watched you on BBC Breakfast this morning, and oh, and you started the challenge drumming to a really big tune, "River Deep, Mountain High." Oh, so, yes. how have you been able to conserve energy through the day? Is it peaks and troughs? <laughs> it's peaks and troughs, absolutely, Larry. You know, now I'm playing a fairly kind of um, quiet, standard four-four uh, drum beat here whilst talking to you. But yeah. you know, I'm playing songs, and I've, I'm in interviewing people so as well as drumming for 24 hours I'm kind of presenting the the amazing output that we've got on the iPlayer throughout the day so it's been quite a challenge but about the energy yeah it's all about conserving energy and not going too wild so I you know yeah. injure myself or get exhausted well drummers can burn from 400 to 600 calories an hour so what Ooh. snacks have you been eating so far well, um, we've had all sorts. I've had a bagel. Um, I had. How did you eat that? Well, I, I was able to. I stop for five minutes every hour just to use the, the toilet, and I can also sometimes stuff some food in my face at the same time. But I'm also fed whilst playing the drums, Larry. So you know, I'm <laughs> I'm being fed. Actually, Greg White, who has been looking after me, one of the many amazing people working with me on this challenge, just fed me a banana. <laughs> Which was, um, so yeah, you can probably catch up on, on the iPlayer if you want to see it. Oh. Um, yeah, uh, uh, yeah, it's just kind of eating when I can and making sure I don't run out of energy, really, Larry. Yeah, because we can pop in, we can tune in and out, we can follow your progress on the BBC iPlayer, which we have yes. been doing. Oh, brilliant. Um, and and um, you're also, of course, being joined by many percussionists yeah. all over the world, yeah. from the world of music, who's joined you already? Oh my goodness, I've been so lucky to have played the drums with some absolutely amazing people already today. Uh, we had Frank Bembini from the Fun Loving Criminals. He's been in with me. Al Murray was here playing the drums with me just now. Um, Steve White. Oh my, Cherise O'Say from Simple Minds. Uh, you know, oh. just some absolutely amazing drummers. And then later on, I've got Clem Burke from Blondie. Clem's given me a drum kit for the challenge, actually. And um, oh, wow. Nico McBrain from Iron Maiden is going to be joining me later as well. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Well, you know what? We are willing you. We are willing you. And, of course, <laughs> we can donate because this is the whole point, raising funds for children in need. And yeah. the big question is, is the quiff still in place? <laughs> the quiff is still there. Um, I've got headphones on at the moment, so it, I think it's been flattened a tiny bit, but I think it's yeah. definitely still... It, Aaron, Aaron, my husband, just um, looked at me and gave me the thumbs up <laughs> and said it's still looking on point. So that's okay. good. But really quickly, Larry, just to echo what you said there. Yeah, you know, we're doing this to raise money for children in need I went back to Ammonford you know from Ammonford in Carmarthenshire obviously Wales is home Ammonford is home Um, and I learnt that there's a project in Ammonford who is you know being helped by funding from children in need and there are projects all over Wales so bbc.co.uk slash pudsey is the place to go Oh, you are amazing. Poor block of wine. <laughs> Dior Keep Cariad. Hoil. <laughs> Hoil Cariad. Bye. Oh, there he goes. And remember, at five to seven tonight, there'll be a special BBC One TV performance.